skincare routine that I have been using for about a week now. Yeah, about a week. Um, I do have a little bit of eczema spots. I suffer from eczema. I'll do a backstory on how I actually, my reason behind starting my skincare line. I'll do a whole other video on that. But I suffer from eczema, mainly during the winter months, month, the cold months. Um, so even though I have my own skincare company, I support other skincare businesses. I follow mainly skincare businesses from my business page, even some from my personal page. It's enough money out here for everybody. And that's what I explain to a lot of people. Because some people will look at me like, why you order stuff from them? And you can make your own or you have your own skincare line. Everyone doesn't offer the same products. Okay? Some things that other skincare companies make, I do not make. I may make them down the line, but I don't make them currently. And... I just like supporting others. So the company that I, whose skincare products I have been using, her name is Shop Stunner Shades. I'll put her Instagram link in the description below. And it's called the, I gotta go check and look at it. Um, I ordered it, like I said, I ordered it. And it came so fast. I love her shipping. Where is it? Oh, I ordered the skincare bundle package and you receive a free drink cream. So with the skincare bundle package, you receive um, a peppermint cocoa butter cleansing oil and it also is supposed to energize and relax you. So, look at that, okay. <laughs> Here's the cleansing oil. I'm gonna name them in the, in the steps that I will be using them. And then we have the Blue Magic face, face Wash and Makeup Remover made with real citrus, aloe vera, and poppy seeds for deep cleansing and makeup removal. You guys, I messed up this label <laughs> using it for my, cause I said I've been using it for about a week. Then we have the Honey Turmeric Mask for lightening and brightening. Here is that. And last but not least, we have the Dream Cream for your face and body for eczema, dark spots, blemishes, stretch marks, and aging. And it's unscented. I always recommend, even though everybody's skin is not the same, but I myself, even for my customers, I always recommend to get my unscented body butter is called Pure. I always recommend that if it's for your face or if you have really sensitive skin. Your skin may can't handle something with fragrance oils. And I don't put anything with fragrance on my face. Period. <laughs> Nothing. Okay, so guys, we're going to get started. So, as I said, first we're going to use the shop, the peppermint cocoa butter cleansing oil. And it has a spray. It comes in a spray bottle. I'm going to spray that on. And rub it in. And this oil is, I can honestly say, like, it does relax you it reminds you of like a aromatherapy if i shall say 
so yeah and if i'm not mistaken please don't quote me on this i believe the cleansing oil is to break down the acne in your pores and you just massage it Okay. Okay. Then we're going to go in with the face wash. I'm just going to wet my hands a little. Put a little face wash on my hands. Put it in. This smells so good also. And it's so refreshing. I can tell that aloe vera is used in this because normally before I started using, before I ordered the skincare bundle kit, I had fresh aloe vera cubes in my freezer. So every night I would Put a aloe vera mask on my face. And if you've used it before, you know how refreshing it can make your skin feel. Okay. So, I'm just gonna wash this off. Guys, I am out of white. Look how my face is. Listen, this did our thing with this cleanser, these products, because I honestly, over the week, I love them. Um, as I was saying, I, I don't like, I'm out of makeup wipes because I honestly don't like wiping my face with wash reds. But after I do use them one time, they're going in the dirty food because wash rags can hold so much bacteria. You don't want that dirt going back on your face after you clean it. Okay, so next, we're going to go in with the Honey Turmeric Mask. And this is how it looks, guys. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Wait a minute. Okay. And I probably should not have wore a white shirt while doing this. Well, it's not a drippy mask, so I should be fine. But you know, turmeric can stain your clothes. And turmeric, it has a smell to it. Some people would say it's an unpleasant smell, but it's not that bad to me. And I also, I cook with turmeric a lot. I'm just gonna get some for my forehead. Might be too much. Can I wipe it in? Do y'all notice how? <laughs> I noticed it when, before I even started making YouTube videos, I noticed it when I would look in the mirror doing my skincare routines. We make some crazy looking faces cleaning our skin. All right, so for the turmeric mask, um, for the turmeric mask, I'm told to leave it on for 15 minutes and then we'll wash it off. So I'll be back. 
Okay guys, it's been 15 minutes. I actually set my stopwatch on my phone. So what did I do in those 15 minutes? Oh, I put my clothes in the dryer in those 15 minutes and was watching YouTube. Um, so now we're gonna wash the turmeric mask off and go to the next step. Okay, I just wanted to make sure all of that turmeric was off my face. Okay, and last but not the least, we're going to moisturize with the dream cream. The dream cream. <laughs> okay. And let me tell y'all, when I first used the dream cream, I did this big old scoop. You know how, well, I don't know if you guys <laughs> do this, but you know that meme where it says, oh, use a drop and you do that extra because I know for a fact I do that with my hair products. <laughs> That's why I'm always buying them. But literally, a little goes a long way. So, I'm gonna show you guys how much I'm actually gonna use. It's how much I'm gonna use, okay? The Dream Cream is also super, super soft and moisturizing. If you're wondering why I'm doing my face like this, I follow an esthetician on Twitter. I can't think of her name offhand, but she said you should moisturize. When you moisturize your face or cleaning your face, you should do upward motions. Because you guys know, like, if, you have, if you've had a facial before, you're laying down and they're behind you. So they're doing all upward motions. You rarely ever feel them going down. I feel like it may wrinkle or sag your skin earlier. I don't know. I'll research that and get back to you. Or if you know why, comment it. Leave it in the comments. Inform me. Educate me. I don't know everything. Okay. But that is it, guys. That is my skincare routine that I have been doing for, as I said, a week now. And I like it, honestly. The products are amazing. I love them. And I have, my skin has been looking more refreshed. But also, guys, ladies and gents, please do not think that a product isn't good because it's not working for you. Everyone's skin is not the same. As I was saying with the 
fragrances on your skin. And also, not only do you have to do take care of your skin, it's what you're putting inside of your body also. Now, I'm not about to preach to you guys. I'm not vegetarian. I'm not vegan. I still eat chicken, red meat. Not too much red meat. But I'm none of that. But I do make sure that I drink plenty of water. Water does the skin good. Drink your water and mind your business. <laughs> no, but really, water, get your water intake because that plays a big part in your skin, okay? I hate, and hate is a strong word, but I hate when I see people bashing skincare businesses or natural hair companies because that company's product didn't work for them. One, maybe you weren't consistent enough with using it, so you didn't give it a chance to work. Two, you could have been using too many products on your face along with that product. Three, maybe those products just aren't for you. And last but not least, as I was just saying, it could be what you're consuming into your body. So, guys, don't bash anybody. We are, I'm all about uplifting people, everybody. Listen, I probably don't even know you, and I'm rooting for you. If I see a post, some motivation, you're motivating me. I will be sitting there on my phone. Yes, it's. <laughs> but really, like, I love to see growth. I love to see people moving forward. And that's one thing about me. I've been at my lowest of the low. I'm not where I want to be, but I am way better off than I have been in the past. And let me tell you, when I was down low, I still was rooting everybody on. At my worst, I still, it was still no hate in my, no hate in me. I am still was cheering others on because what's for you is going to be for you. When it's your time, it's going to be your time. So you just have to be patient. That's the easiest way to put it. You have to be patient. God may be telling you that it's not your time. It was some things that I had to get together with within myself before God blessed me with certain things. I'm not going to get spiritual with you guys, but yeah, I just don't like the bashing others. I don't like that at all. Because with all this crazy stuff going on, I'm sure everybody knows what's going on right now. We don't need that. Like we're in a pandemic and I feel like people mental health whew, that's a whole nother story but we don't need the bashing and the negativity and it's a new year everybody should have started off fresh okay i'm not gonna wrap you guys up too much but as i said i will leave shop stunner shades link to her instagram in the comment in the description below sorry and that's the skincare routine that i've been using for the past week so guys i hope you liked the video if you're not already please subscribe to my channel like comment and share oh and turn those notifications on so you can know when the girl is posting okay hope everyone have what time is it enjoy the rest of your night I'm about to do some things for Rodé & Co. Also, I'm going to leave the link to my personal page, my business page, and my business website in the com the sorry guys <laughs> in the description below. Bye guys. Hope everyone enjoy the rest of their night.